Alright, so here we go guys, we're back and I'm playing more Friday the 13th as Jason, part 5 Jason. Let's get straight into it, no time to talk. They shouldn't be here, Jason. Grab these Stop two them. knives immediately and what I always do is instantly teleport to the phone and trap it. Instantly. Fuck, it's on the main building too by the looks of it, which is... Pretty easy for the survivors to get to. It's going to be quite annoying for me. This Jason's not bad. He's got quite a few traps and throwing knives. But uh, throwing knives on 324 ping is fucked. Okay, but we'll see how we go. Okay, there's some survivors in here, I think. Yep, there we go. Let's try and... What the fuck? Fucking... Look at that! How did that fucking miss? 344... Okay. Maybe I just didn't... Aim it properly or some shit. I might... Oh wow, actually got her. I might just try and fuck her up with throwing knives. If I can't, I'm gonna just abandon this Vanessa because it's too difficult to chase her. She's, she'll just loot me. She's got ridiculous stamina. But if I can manage to at least get her with some of these... I think one more. She should be on shit health. You know, I'm trying to... I'm not aiming at her because I know the lag's affecting this. So I'm just trying to aim anywhere and hopefully one will get a fucking Jesus this is fucked yeah okay see ya oh oh <laughs> and that was a Vanessa too wow that worked out well morphed right onto her you cannot get any Don't better than that. Jason. They deserve to die. Okay, there's one over Make there going to like that me. house. Okay, it looks like they've... I don't know if they put the gas in, but I'm just going to trap the... You know what, I should go and trap the blue car. Yeah, because that one... There's no boat, which is good. It's very difficult to... trap the boat. and defend against the boat. I think part 7 Jason is fast underwater so you can even if you know they're escaping by the boat you can sort of get to them quickly but I don't think this Jason is fast underwater from memory. Alright I'm just gonna grab this throwing knife in the hopes that I can get someone but I can hear them putting in gas, so it must be here. Yes! Yes! Fuck you, you fucking bitch. Vanessa! That council is fucked. I'm just gonna chop her. Because she may have... Get up. Oh god, alright. Okay, they're taunting me. Yeah, okay. Alright, let's trap the, um... Yes! Don't have a... You fuck! God damn it! Kill them. <sighs> that is so fucking annoying when they've got a pocket knife. Are you serious? You wanna die? Oh my... Yeah, okay, that's why she was doing it. Don't let them... You know, I've had survivors with three fucking pocket knives before. You know, it's fucked. There's not much I can do here, really. Just try a random... Yeah, it's, it's very difficult in the lag. 
so they're just gonna... Holy shit, 392 ping. What the, you know... Ah, oh, man, see? Okay. I always have this kill hotkeyed to Y, because it's a fairly fast kill. Yeah. It's good to have a fast kill yeah. like that, alright? Some mother. of them, the animation is drawn out for quite a while. But if you've got a fast kill like that, the other one's um, the kill where he punches their head off. That's pretty fast as well. Yeah, it's good because if, if they're all around a car and you just want to kill someone quickly, you can do so. Alright, so one, two, three, four, five, they've got Tommy Jarvis. It seems like they're all teaming up. They must be in a party or communicating somehow. <laughs> ah You fucking noob, rage quit. that one? No, alright, where was it? It wasn't the phone, so it must be here. You can tell what trap it is, I believe. It's when it's got a circle inside. Oh, she's on full health, so she must have healed. Yeah, it's quite hard to tell, but see how the phone one doesn't have like a red circle inside it? And the other two traps, you can't really tell because the car's there, you know? So, yeah, a lot of the times I find I'm just guessing where, the, where to go. This is going to be annoying. Three Vanessas. There's nothing I can do here. They've got the other car repaired. All they've got to do is get into it. I've trapped it, though. The driver's side door, so... Damn, was hoping she'd come out. <sighs> this is fucking shit. Alright. It'd be good to have rage. See in the top left, once that builds up fully, you get rage. You get rage by basically getting hit a lot by the survivors, the counsellors. So it's quite good if they gang up on, gang up on you and hit you a lot. You do get rage quicker. And it becomes harder for them to stun you as well when they hit you. Alright, what can we do? Nope, you're not getting in that window. You're going to keep running and using that sprint meter, bitch. I know you're Vanessa and you've got a disgusting amount of stamina. See, the thing is, if I leave her now and go chase someone else, she's just going to regenerate all that stamina and you have to start all over again, so... It's kind of annoying, but... <laughs> this is going to be really, really fucking annoying. She's going straight in, yep. God, I wish I had rage so I could just break through these doors straight away. Part 8 Jason and Part 4 Jason are great for breaking the doors. It only takes them three swings and it goes down. No! Keep running. Two, three. Three Vanessas and Tommy. Jesus. I'm surprised they haven't tried to escape in that other car. It's kind of bizarre. Help! Oh God. Look at this. How much fucking stamina. Get fucked. You cannot run for this long. Look at that! Still going! Ah! 
God damn it, that was it. That was the moment. Please no! <laughs> I'm gonna keep on her. She cannot have infinite stamina. This is ridiculous. Got her. I hit her. Alright, she's gonna go out. Okay, quickly, quickly, quickly. This is what it takes to take care of a Vanessa. It's absolutely fucked. Especially when I'm battling 330 ping. Okay, she's gonna go in here. Probably should go and see what the other survivors are doing, but... You, you better not have a... Yes! Get the fuck out of here. Christ. I was going to say, if she had a pocket knife after all that... Hunt them down and man, them that's pay. like rage quit time. Why haven't they tried escaping in that car? What the hell's going on? I know I've trapped the driver's side door of the yellow car, but still, like, all this time... Like, I've been running around chasing this Vanessa... It's probably like eight minutes alone chasing that Vanessa, you know. Tommy Jarvis is still here. Alright, I've got rage. Yeah, I think as time goes on, you tend to get rage as well, so... Alright, let's see. Oh, there you are. It's another... Ah, too far away. Alright, so rage, you can just go straight through the doors. You don't have a pocket knife. Okay, I went for the quick kill there. Because I knew the other survivors were around me. And they'd probably hit me, so... It just had to be quick. Are you serious, Tommy Jarvis? What the fuck? Make them suffer like we did. Alright, only two of them left. We can do this. Ah, fuck, that should have hit him. So Tommy Jarvis will have a pocket knife. Where the fuck is he? Ah, oh, okay. Yeah, Tommy Jarvis will have a pocket knife and a healing spray. So what I like to do with him is... Because this one looks like he's going to be a pain in the ass to catch. Like they all usually are. I'm just going to try and slash him to death. <laughs> Wrong way, you idiot. <laughs> Given up. Okay. Hunt them right. down and make them pay. So now there's this Vanessa left. What the f what the fuck? Look at how she's moving. What the fuck is going on? Look at this. <laughs> it's like she's on ice skates. <laughs> this is stupid. And she's aiming. It must just be glitched. She must be running. What? Ah, oh, this is annoying. If I had throwing knives, could have stopped her, but... <laughs> Look at this! <laughs> Fucking... Oh! Look at that! Bullshit! Yeah, there's nothing I can do here. I've got no... No throwing knives to slow her down. This wouldn't be draining much of her stamina either. Um, actually, let's try this. Fuck! So this could be what the remainder of the match looks like. She could win by doing... I don't know why I'm not grabbing her. Like, what ping is she on? Look, look how close I am and I'm missing. See what I mean? 
So I'm on 312 ping, she's on 96, alright, so there's definitely a... So maybe, like, when she's right near me, she's actually out of reach on her screen or something. Oh! Get in that fucking fireplace, you bitch. Take that. There we go. Look at that, kill them all. I don't know why that Tommy Jarvis gave up, just stood there. He could have tried die, swinging me, um, Make them hitting me with the baseball bat. That would have, that would have given him some more time to run off, you know, but he just sort of stood there like, oh, okay, I'm done, like I'm done. Never, ever, ever give up. Always make Jason, you know, I, it's annoying when it happens to me, but as a counsellor, always make it as difficult as possible for Jason, you know. Like, even when I'm on the limping state, and I've basically got no health left, you know, I'm just going in and out of the same window, and he's broken it. I tend to, like, just keep doing that. It just buys a bit more time for the other survivors as well to to do some things. So, yeah, don't ever just sort of drop the controller and say, oh, I'm done. Keep swinging that baseball bat or running or whatever, yeah. But that was actually bizarre. I don't know why they didn't escape in the car. They should have done that. They would have had a very good chance of getting away. So they mustn't have been very good players. But yeah, anyway, that was quite fun. Part 5 Jason. He's pretty... Hang on. I want to see what he's... Because I used to use Part 2 Jason a lot. Because he's got, he starts off with a lot of traps, and I do love my traps. Yeah, see part two, Jason, he's got a lot of traps and he can more fast, but his shift speed is atrocious, okay. Um, yeah, I knew he has throwing knives, alright, stalk was pretty good and can run, so that's it, okay. Shitty stun resistance, shit grip strength, shit defense. Whatever about those, but yeah, he's pretty good for the throwing knives. Um, if you're on a good connection, he's probably a good one to go with. A couple more traps than some of the other survivors. Uh, sorry, Jasons tend to have. Oh, here we go. What's going on? Rage. Oh, I'm still in the game, am I? What? Okay, I don't know what he's talking about. Alright, so... What else? You got part 6. I've never been the biggest fan of this one. <sighs> Alright, so he's got throwing knives like part 5. He can't run though. Um, he can shift a bit quicker. Sense. So similar to part 5, I guess, but can't run. I don't know. I've... This one's probably been my least favourite Jason out of all of them, to be honest. This one's quite good. He's got strong... His uh, machete that he has is quite a powerful weapon. It only takes a couple of swings before they're in the sort of uh, limping state. And he's fast underwater. Uh, that's... To me, that's kind of useless. That's just like, oh, okay, if they manage to get the boat, you know, then you're lucky you're this Jason, but... It's not something that I'd rely on, you know, water speed. It's not really a good one to have, to be honest. Um, sense, yeah, okay. This one's pretty good, like I said, part 8 and part 4. Jason here, destruction. That means they can break down the doors a lot quicker. And part 3, Jason, I tend to find a lot of players like playing as this one. Uh, probably because... Okay, he's got weapon strength, same as part... Seven. So his weapon does decent damage. Grip strength. Okay, what is that? Counselors have a tougher time. I don't know. That's just pointless to me because basically, if I grab someone and they don't have a pocket knife, I'm instantly mashing one of the buttons to kill them. There's no way they can get out that quick. So that's probably a useless thing, in my opinion. And part 9, Jason, the only good thing I find him for is shifting. He's, he can shift very quickly. His regeneration speed on shift is insane. Yeah, see? Increased shift regeneration speed. So if you like using that, use this Jason. 
For me personally, I quite like part two, Jason, just for the traps. And he can morph around quickly. Uh, even though his shift speed is fucking terrible. I like part four, Jason, and part eight, because they can break down the doors quickly. Part seven's quite good because of the strong weapon strength, and part five because of the throwing knives. Part six, don't really like him that much. Part nine, eh, not really. And part three, yeah, he's okay. They're all they're all pretty good, you know. Like there's nothing, there's no wrong Jason. It's basically all based on your playstyle. Like what do you like to do? Then you you'll go ahead and choose the Jason that's suited to your playstyle. You know what I mean? So yeah, that's it, guys. Uh, thanks for watching that playthrough on. Friday the 13th is Jason. I'll see you in the next video. I'm out.